This is Cassie on behalf of MyCard, we're live at Finnovate Europe and we've been talking to people today about how they see digital identity will impact financial services in the year ahead. I think digital identity is going to be very important because uh, uh, we used to say that on the internet nobody knows you're a dog and, uh, uh, and now we have to find a way to uh, control and manage our identity on, on the net and it has to be easy, secure and if you feel really comfortable about just uh, sharing your identity and you know you can control it, you can withdraw, you can erase, you know, as soon as you manage your identity in an easy way, I think it's going to boom and, and, and it's going to be very easy to, to do business on the internet. As the world sits today, everybody has data on you already that you don't necessarily have felt you would have shared had you given the cho had the choice. So digital identity, uh, the way it's going to be in the world going forward is actually it's a customer centric view. So you are, it's your data, you own it. You're not a customer of a bank who has the right to own it, but any interaction you have with a service provider enables you to share your data if that's what you want to do to receive that service. So uh, you know, digital identity is probably the biggest headache that this industry has really got to start thinking about and actually using it as a way to stop thinking that they have a right to it. Um, because actually the customer is an individual who chooses to use a service. I think as people transact more and more online um, and organisations try and remove costs from their, from, their, from their business, having a seamless way of uh, identifying who people are is going to be imperative to, to keep ahead commercially. A digital identity is a great way of um, being able to do things online, purchase things online, apply for credit online. Sure, digital identity is uh, important, especially nowadays where everybody carries uh, with them a mobile device. Digital identification will be crucial uh, to get uh, financial companies going mobile. A digital identity is a complementary product to the value proposition of mobile. Without that full end-to-end -end proposition, then con new consumers to a new market are going to find it difficult to trust and, and use the, the, the new service. I de definitely see digital identity taking off this year. I think what, you know, it's really about trust and you know, how people can build trust in banks and financial institutions and I think digital identity is really key to that. In financial case, you need to, to identify this person correctly without asking him to go to your office and to sign some agreements and etc. Et it's extremely too important to know exactly who you're talking to, who you're transacting with, and know that that is actually the person uh, behind the, the transaction. Digital identity and trust in general is going to be a huge theme, I think. I mean, the more you see about it, the more trust you can bring to any website, say Airbnb, all the services that you start to use as the web really consumerizes over these years is going to be a huge co component of, of that really spreading fast. Trust is such a massive issue around personal finance. Um, so I think we've got so many other hurdles to do in terms of winning consumers' trust that just them onboarding with us and confirming their identity sort of needs not to be another barrier. So if we can make that easier and um, give more people more confidence around that, then that could be uh, massive. I, I think digital identity is, a, is an important component, uh, but I think as companies and people start to transact using social networks and so on, you will have not one digital identity, you will have many, but they will mesh together and it will be harder and harder to fake them. It's already today, I think it's harder to fake your Facebook profile than your passport. I think digital identity would be critical as it is with everything today. We've all got one, we always will have one, and most of us have got more than one now. Digital identity, it will be uh, more and more spread. Uh, but once again, we need to manage, we need to be scared about frauds. I mean, people that want to steal our digital identity. That sometimes is more important than money. So we need to protect our digital identity. Digital identity is quite a big challenge because um, we all want our users to have a simple way to interact with us. Uh, but on the other hand, we want to have a secure identity, so it's quite a big challenge for us as a, an editor of e-commerce website. We need a um, simple identity, trustable identity, but no pain for the final users. Some way of identifying and authenticating people across all of these platforms uh, has become a priority.